Welcome back to Graveyard Keeper. I'm Caladorn, and uh, we're just going to uh, continue uh, where we left off yesterday. Mm. Read a bit up on the game since then, but this is still very much a blind playthrough, um, and I think that's kind of uh, amusing as well. So, um, hmm. I wonder. Okay, so we have some quests here. Find a stump. Demonstrate that you're worth talking to. Reach five points on the graveyard. Um, okay, so I'm going to clean up the graveyard some more. also gives us these little research thingies but it really takes out a lot of energy apparently some of these graves are hmm, exhumable I cannot do so, but because of their negative score, it might be a good idea to actually exhume them. We want as many white skulls as possible on a corpse to uh, get a high grade. So I can exhume this one, but I don't have any kind of gravestone or grave fence. And to be honest, I'm not sure if I have any kind of... Um, um, blueprints or whatever to, to do that as of yet. I think I need the... Um, yes, I need this research before I can do it. Um, so what do we have? We have wooden sticks. Well, let's mine a bit. Does this take energy from me? Exploring a bit. So now we can do the simple gravestones. Um, I probably should eat some. I can drag these down here, but yeah, I'll just eat them here anyways. It is getting dark though, so I'm not sure where I make the, the gravestones. You'd think I'd make them here. But apparently I don't. And if I go to a grave, I need to have it in my inventory. Let's go check inside the morgue if I can make gravestones there. Oh, I also wanted to apologize a bit because of my keyboard noises in the previous episode. It turns out that I hadn't modified my microphone settings so that they were on... Uh, the microphone was on omnidirectional, uh, which is not ideal, since that means you can hear my keyboard quite well. Um, nah. Blah, 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 indeed. Where do I craft the gravestones then? Mortuary desk. Well, it's the middle of the night, so I guess I shall go home and sleep instead. How about here? I can make stockpiles. The trunk. Oh! There's an outhouse here. In we go. And bed. 
sleep. Very good, saving progress, thank you. Yes, you seem to be quite refreshed all the time. So, okay, where do... Can, does this thing tell me where I can make this? I mean... It's so strange that neither inside the morgue this do I have a quest or something that I need to do find a stamp and sell meat to Horadric let's go back to town okay Everything is ready, Monsignor. Good. Were there any problems? No, Monsignor. Except there was this strange fellow snooping around. Oh, there he is. Hot! Guys, calm down. I live here, at the graveyard. Guys, why, he's a cultist for certain, Monsignor. You know, the Archbishop is a good friend of mine. He appointed me as keeper of the local graveyard. Interesting. But I can believe you're a friend of his. Though it's not a terribly impressive feat. Just pay him a compliment and he's your friend. But appointing someone to the graveyard is certainly outside his area of responsibility. I'll have to visit him and remind him of the limits of his authority again. Would you join me at the witch burning ceremony? Mm -hmm. It would be my honor. So, how did you find yourself in such an interesting position? You know, I wanted to be a graveyard keeper ever since I was a kid. I strongly suggest you to avoid bothering people with such nonsense. Didn't approve of that. Here I am, the Great Inquisitor. I protect the one true faith and humankind itself. We're having a tough time in the town. The ship of the dead is already overloaded and there is a new one stuck in the shipyard. Your graveyard is opening again at a suspiciously auspicious time. The dark cult is rising. I can feel it. Righteous anger rises within it, it with it in my soul. We haven't revealed a witch for a long time, and now we're lighting up the second one this year. And it's only the beginning. Burn the witch! Burn, burn the witch! Light the fire. Yes, Monsignor. Long live the Great Inquisitor! Hurrah! 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 This is, this is awful. So, you work with a lot of dead bodies, huh? Yes, I think it's part of my job. And you live right beside this hill near the graveyard. That right? Yes. Interesting. Interesting. You know, I need someone to be my friend here at the village. My friend is a friend of the Holy Inquisition. Villagers. They're different from us town citizens. You can't trust them. But you're new here. You might notice something unusual. Hmm. Okay. Sure, it'll be a pleasure to be your friend. A wise choice. Friendship is based on trust and goodwill. To earn my trust and to be a friend of the Inquisition, you will first have to show your goodwill. So, I have a couple of minor tasks for you. What kind of tasks? Everything in its time. Today is a day of wrath, not a day of sweating the minor details. We can talk next. Venus symbol? Something? Or any other. I like to come here. There is no other place where I can feel my holy wrath so deeply. 
Okay, that guy certainly was creepy. I think I need to adjust the sound a little bit. Hmm. Okay. That was fairly horrid. Just looking for food to have for my energy. The flowers doesn't really give much, but they, they at least give me a little bit. There we go. What is this? I don't need the technology. That seems to be the donkey. Yes, it's the donkey. Which means that I should go back to the morgue. Interesting way of getting research things though. Chopping down trees and bushes. I can. What happens if I chop down this tree? Wow, very energy consumption. Um, apparently I have to chop these ones up as well, but yeah, the corpse. Here we go. Do our little morbid task. There, done. I'm not sure if... Well, let's try making a new grave. Since it at 99% gravesite, there we go. this up it seems to be a rather crappy corpse though great okay so someone said that you should sell the tools to the blacksmith and buy new ones back but with a half closed grave that's probably not going to be the best I don't need the energy at the moment, so let's just zoom home so we can get some sleep. There we go. Apparently also uh, you get more energy when sleeping at night than during day, I think. Okay, so I had a small derp there, um, so we're back now. Um, what I'm going to do is to repair my shovel. And well, at least I'm going to try to repair the shovel. There we go. Yay, I got a shovel. Um, and that took 5% off my whetstone. That's, not, that's better than I thought, actually. I don't understand what happened to my certificate thing, um, because as far as I know, I should have received a certificate for the dead body that I processed and buried yesterday, and I, I definitely didn't sell it to the innkeeper since I have zero money, and there is obviously no graveyard certificates in here, so maybe that's a bug, uh, not sure, maybe I lost it, but yeah. so. What I'm going to do now is that I'm going to research this saw and get the recipe for Fletch and Wood Billet and also the blueprint for a sawhorse. And I'm also going to chop a few trees 
to get the research I need to also mine some rocks to get the these researchers so that I can actually make things. So I've looked up and gotten some help on how to do things. But I'm still confused as to what to do with these. It's really nice to walk around with them, but... This is very amusing. Um, broom, broom. Broom, broom, broom. No, no, don't go into the... No, no, stay on the road. No, 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 come back here. Don't, don't leave me. I want you. You're, you're my precious log. No, 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 no. Back to the road. Um, so I'll, I guess I'll take this with me at back home. Um, probably to process it at the, uh, no, no. Um, well, let's hope it can go through the irrigation. I guess it can. Um, and we'll go up here. This is very interesting. Um, so this is how you transport more than one log. Um, <clears throat> um, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. So yeah. let's put them here. We could put them in here, actually. I completely forgot about this thing. Um, let's dig up these. Pretty house plants that we probably don't need. And uh, I'm still puzzled by how much energy it takes to actually dig up some bushes. Hey, come here. <laughs> come on. So let's see here. I don't know. Um, let's build a saw horse there. Of course, that is going to take the rest of my energy, I presume. Yay, I got a saw horse. Now I can make wooden billets and flitches. Not sure what the flitch is. Never heard that expression before, but it's probably some kind of a plank, I would assume. Oh, this is where I make gravestones. Thank you, game, for telling me that. <laughs> Very useful. Well, at least you viewers now know that you need to craft a sawhorse to make wooden gravestones. Isn't that nice? <laughs> um, let's see if we can uh, go pick up the, uh, the other logs that I left down here when I was confused as to what to do with them. So... Oh no, it's gonna, it's gonna hit the, the light there. Mm -hmm. Cat, can you please go down and stop going behind my monitor, please? Oh. Can we build anything else? No, I need flitches and wood beams to build a timber stock but I don't need a stock part. The furnace I need lots of stone and simple iron parts which I cannot make yet. No. Oh I'll go to bed. So it's good team good thing to sleep while it is night since yes. Save progress I am so refreshed. Yes, you're always very refreshed. Um, let's see how we're doing with the research. We need more red here. No, no. Okay, so the tree is too big for me. No, you have an axe, but oh no, that that trunk is obviously too thick. Um, no, I, I should, probably shouldn't do the room room thing when I when I only have one. People are going to think that I'm mad. Um, slightly insane, yes. Mm -hmm. 
but it's okay. Oh, 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 oh. Now we can do it again. No, that's the wrong way. Okay, I probably should stop doing that. Um, no, is this thing full? No, no. Come back here. Um, so. Seven. Let's see if I can find any rocks around here. Is this a rock? Yes, it is. Okay, so I can carry a big piece of stone around, but obviously I cannot carry a trunk of a tree. Oh. Well. So it's Venus Day. That probably means that the bishop or the inquisitor is around. I don't. I don't remember which one. Um, okay, I have ten now, so that means that we can unlock either mining. But I haven't seen anything to mine, so let's just go with the firewood for now. Wait, I didn't have to go to the blacksmith. You have a grindstone here. <clears throat> okay, we want some wooden billets. We can make those at the sawhorse. How handy. Mm -hmm. Make more of them. Probably need to eat some flowers because it is perfectly normal to eat flowers. Especially flowers that you do not know what are since it said study not complete. Tasty flower, tasty flower. There we go, that should probably be enough. Thank you. Now, hey, why don't you? Um, yep, I can make a chopping place now. There. Uh, it's almost night. Need wooden billets, of course. Um, let's see if there's anything else we can build. Furnace, maybe fridge, the iron parts. I know I want a furnace, but I'm not sure about these iron parts. Let's go to sleep. All the sets. And of course I went to bed so early that I'm going to wake up in the middle of the night. Basement is always a good idea to do when you're not sure what to do. Oh, I got nails. Interesting. Ooh, iron parts. I should have cleaned out the basement earlier. I don't remember why they do it like that. Ooh, tasty. Guess it's soon time to eat flowers again. Seems to be nearing that point. I'm barely, barely have woken up in the morning, and it's not even morning yet, and I'm out of energy. This is this is sad. The sadness is real. Um, hello, chop. Yes, thank you. the donkey's been around yet nope I'm gonna pick some flowers because you know need them flowers need something to eat big mushroom handily that also gives me XP though 
I think as the XP I don't need much of because I think I have plenty of green XP. Oh, I don't have enough energy to pick a flower. Hmm. Yeah, it's hard work picking flowers. Mm. Mm. Why does it say... Oh, yes, I didn't <coughs> finish the grave. That could possibly be a good idea to do. There we go. Oh, I got something that I can... Mm -hmm. I need to store something in here. Let's eat a few mushrooms. No, no, no. I don't want to put you in here. Uh, this I definitely don't need for a little while. Probably not that until I get the stamp either. I wonder if I should just have put that corpse in the river instead since it gave me an extra minus one. Oh well. I can put the crafting materials in here. Uh, does it help if I click Oh so, oh, so you can click, uh, hold shift while you click, and you don't have to do the, uh, the thing that I had do, did there, the slider thing. Um, I'm really out of energy. It's late in the evening, but I'll go into town, hoping that the tavern is open, even at night. What's this? Oh, examine. Read. Oh yeah, yeah this one. pick some mushrooms while we're here. No, I cannot pick more mushrooms. I shall eat a few mushrooms and I will pick some more mushrooms. I don't want to chop trees. Vroom, vroom. I think someone had an accident with a cart here. There's some bones as well down there, poor thing. And I still find it very funky that I'm walking in a huge field of wheat, but God forbid that I can touch it. Because there are so many guards around watching me and everyone in the village would see that, oh, he's stealing our wheat. Or maybe they wouldn't see me because I'm in a field of wheat. Anyways, game logic. Trade. Oh, here you go. Thank you. Um... No, I'm not going to waste my hard-earned money on buying food from you. Arr, bad luck. Not today. Okay. If you say so. Oh, no, not him. I want to talk to him. <laughs> Maybe I should buy some... How many iron parts? No, of course I forgot how many... back tomorrow. I need to check how many iron parts I actually have in that chest before I buy some because money seems to... Uh, now I keep going up here again to that guy who doesn't want to talk to me because he's too busy. Um, if there is one thing that I would uh, complain slightly meow about to the devs, please add a map as soon as possible. Please. But I do like these, these little details, like you leave footprints when you walk on the road. I like that. I'm in a, I'm in a hurry. I need to sleep before it becomes daytime. Oh, it's a lightning storm. To bed we go. All the nice energy coming back. I feel invigorated. And of course, he's going to say, I feel so refreshed. See? Told you so. <clears throat> I 
um, yeah, how many iron parts do I need? I have two. And I need eight. So I need six more. Let's go check if I have enough money to afford that. Or maybe we should wait for the donkey. Well, if the donkey is coming, he'll probably be coming on the road together with us. Or <coughs> together with us. Uh, I mean <coughs> in the opposite direction of us. Yeah, we seem to be fine. It's interesting though how this village seemed to have at least one person dying every day. There he is. I wonder if the donkey is thinking to himself, are we there? Are we there yet? I know talking donkeys tend to 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 be very uh, obsessed with whether they're there yet or not. I've seen it in some movies. Oh, no, no, trade, not food. So, whoa. Oh, but I, I get twenty of them. Oh no, no, no. <laughs> I cannot afford this yet. Huh. <sighs> I wish there were more vendor vendors in the game. Uh, but I guess we shall have to. Uh, Process <clears throat> more corpses and sell more death certificates. Mm -hmm. Yes, I know. I'm coming. I'm coming. Don't worry. Uh, I'm going to stop here and pick some flowers. The corpse can wait. Flowers were so nice, nice and red and cute. Mm -hmm. Broom, broom, broom. Here we go. Into the morgue with us. Uh, the talking skull. Let's see. Uh, three skulls. We'll take out the flesh. Here we go. Ah. So, let's see here. Oh no, it's night again, but this time I have lots of energy. Two skulls. Hmm. But I need the death certificates. I can exhume them again later. Because that's what we do around here. We bury them. Maybe I should dig the grave. Like so. We will put you in here and we will inter you and dig you down. And that will give us a certificate. Thank you. And we can dig you up again and throw you in the river. I like this idea. No, I need an exhumation permission. Okay. Oh well. My graveyard will be uh, very much in the red when it comes to uh, bonus points. Anyways, we need more stone. Hmm. Where can we find stone? Oh, yes, we can find stone in our own yard. There we go. Is this it? Yes, it is. I wonder if the larger stones and the smaller stones gives different yields. Nope, they don't, which is interesting. So the small one also gave two stones, and this big one should give two, two, two stones. No, it gave me three. Okay, so a little bit better then. I think I'll go to bed while it's still dark, so I can get the energy up quickly. No, it's getting light. Oh well, sleep a little bit then. Ah, wake up. So where are we now in terms of experience? Um, the 
can extract blood and fat. Nice. Okay, let's take this one. And I would like to do some gardening, but we'll leave that for another for another time. So Donkey, where are you? Are you here yet? Probably need more stone rather than wood, but... I hope better tools will in mean that I retain more energy when I do these mining things and chopping things. Because I'm losing very much energy on this, as is at the moment. I need more stone, I think. 13 in my inventory. Oh, it would be easy, simpler if I could just close the inventory with the same key. That is also something that uh, would be handy. There you go. To eat a few flowers. I wonder why the flowers give more energy than the berries and the mushroom. Because I really know that I wouldn't eat flowers if I could eat berries, and I think that I would feel more satisfied when eating berry. Oh, yeah, there you are. I'll just mind this and I'll come attend. So let's see here. That means I can probably research something as well before I go to bed. In we go. Autopsy. Let's extract the fat. Oh, that made... That's very handy. That made the red skull white. Um... Blood. Oh, of course, time to eat flour. Okay, uh, four. Oh, this would be a nice one. And if anyone wondered why I didn't extract the meat, well, um, it seems that that is a bad idea. Now I have a problem though, I need to use the potion because I really need to bury this corpse, man. <clears throat> and digging, of course, takes away most of my energy. Here you go. That is my first positive grave. Hurrah! And I got a burial certificate for it as well. Now I need to run so I can get back and get some sleep before the night goes too quick. So we'll zoom a little bit with the shift key and expend all of our energy that way. Not enough energy. Ah, uh, let me in. And on that note, I think that that is a good place to end the episode. So, um, <clears throat> catching all the Zeds and all that stuff. Thank you all for joining me, and uh, I hope that you enjoyed the episode, even though it was a bit wonky this time, uh, and I had way too little of the voiceover dialogue that I would I, I think that is fun to do even though I mess it up a few times every now and then so take care of yourselves and each other and uh, of course may the power of the yek be with you all bye